life groups. Uh, life groups are where our life and our faith really intersect one another. It's where the church gets to come home with us, oftentimes literally to our very homes, where we meet in homes around the city and we share our life together, we share our faith together. It's one of the, the main ways that we see in the New Testament how the church grows. It's a way that we see that the church comes together to actually be the church where we care for one another, where we love one another, where we, we actually carry each other's burdens, it describes. There's something about life groups and being with other people as we walk down this path and this journey of faith, of understanding who God is and what He wants for us more and more. And there's, there's nothing else quite like just having people in our world, in our homes, in our lives that know us and can see us for who we really are that can help us grow and encourage us. Life groups are where that happens. Uh, it's, it's what scripture talks about in James 5, 16, where it talks about that if we come uh, together and confess our sins to one another, which sounds so, so crazy, so strange to want to do that. And it's not a formal thing. It just means we come to a place where, you know what, we can be transparent, or we can, we can really be who we really are. Not the surface, not everything's fine, not everything's just okay, but we can actually be ourselves and other people get to see and know who we are. It's where the authenticity comes out. And, and it says that when we come to that place, that's actually where we're gonna find healing. It, it's where we're gonna actually find this process of freedom that comes into our heart and our life. It's where we're able to put to rest the things from our, our yesterdays. Uh, it's in that context of being with other people on that same journey. And it's why we love life groups so much and why we want you to get to hear the story of some people who have been in our life groups and have gotten to experience this. Hello, my name is Marianne Diaz and I came to Bayside back in December. We sat behind the women's group leader and she introduced herself and I just knew right then that we were gonna be connected somehow and I think God put her there for us and for me especially. I have grown leaps and bounds in my walk with Christ. I've grown in my Bible exposure. I've grown in my testimony. I tell you, we had a trauma situation in December happen to us with my girls, and um, her best friend was killed in the line of duty, and it was a very hard situation. I um, knew then that the ladies would get me to where I needed to be, and I call them at 10 o'clock at night and ask them for prayer and I know that they were praying and I know that sustained myself as well as the Crumber family and my daughters through that dark, dark time. Yeah, so we're Nate and Jessica and we actually came to Bayside through our daughter. She actually had a friend who uh, her family was attending Bayside and so we decided to give it a shot and we just really loved it. Being part of a life group has really helped us to feel a sense of community. Um, that we haven't felt in the past. Um, we originally came from a very large church. Trying to get connected was a little more challenging. It also took a little more initiative on our part. Um, and so uh, it's something that we had thought about doing but hadn't done yet. Right after we had joined the life group, um, my father had a heart attack and it, it just really caught everybody by surprise. You know, in moments like that, you're really looking for any sense of hope um, and, and something to cling on to. And um, our life group just really stepped up and immediately they were praying for us. Um, they were checking on us every day. So that was really uh, an awesome um, way to kind of see what really the life groups are all about. So we want to invite you to check out a life group. They're going to be starting up here in just a couple of weeks. And we believe and we are praying and confidently expect that God wants to use a life group in your life this year.